Sharon Hall here, 5030, and I have a couple things I'd like to share with you that I did over the weekend. The first is a card with a stamp set from uh, Gina Kay. The sentiment says, wishing you a harvest of sweet memories. I colored the apples and basket with my Copics. I'm not exactly sure what background paper I used, but it's craft uh, paper for the card. And then there's a little bit of that celebration glitter ribbon holding the embellishment in there. That and the baskets on fo one thickness of foam tape. And on the back, I used my new stamp I just got from Staples, which is right here. They're really not very expensive, and they'll do the design you want. And it's sort of the sort of clear polymer. I don't know. It's it's okay until something better comes along. So there's that card. This one is one of my gorgeous girls. And the background is from Divine. And then I, uh, it's on the Gina K Luxury card stock. And it does not show through with the Copics, but it's very difficult to cut with the dies. So I have a couple of little torn places here. I was thinking of maybe putting a flat back pearl there, but I'm not sure. I lace the ribbon through and put some little ribbon flowers on. So there she is. And the third project I did tonight, I had one of those black, they're like a uh, DVD or CD box, and I didn't want the black. So I took paper from Graphic 45. It is the Tropical Travelogue Seaside Holiday Paper. I used the green to cover the box all the way around, and then on the opposite side of the green, was this picture with escape. I think we do use our stamps to escape sometimes in a good way. And on the back, I, right now I have my MFT stamps in there, but since it has this little sort of ledger paper I could add to or change, then I had some sort of teal beads. Bring this up a little. And I put those around the edges. And yes, I do have packing tape to hold them on. I just wanted to get done. And here's the front. That's the black that the whole entire box was. And inside it has a nice pattern. So there's my NFT stamps, which I use these rings to categorize. Like there's winter, there's uh, holidays, and spring and summer. And there's some other ones. So those are my stamps in the box. Thank you all for watching. Uh, there are some rough edges on this. It's not my better work, but uh, it does look better than the black. So thank you all for watching, and comment if you'd like, and have a very blessed day.